In this video, we will be sharing some model painting tips and tricks. The fill tool is one of my favorites for quickly applying color to large areas. When edge detection is enabled, it helps by identifying sharp edges and boundaries, preventing color from spilling over to adjacent surfaces, making precise application easy. However, on complex models, selecting each facet can be tedious. A useful tip is to first fill larger adjacent areas with edge detection on to create a boundary. Then, with edge detection off, you can fill in the remaining areas without needing to make as many individual selections. In the following example, to change the color of the belly, the edge boundary isn't as well defined as it's not a perfectly sharp edge. So, it's necessary to increase the smart fill angle. Adjusting the angle will provide you with different results and can help capture certain details. For us, 7 seems to be the best setting but introduces a new problem with colors and the gaps between the filled areas. Using the gap fill tool, we can blend and fill in those gaps. In situations where there are no defined edges, a great technique is to draw the separation, creating a boundary, and then filling in the color. In our next video, we will go over some tips and tricks on how to improve surface quality.